Well, howdy ho. Here's uh, another, another <coughs> uh, JBL magnet motor assembly that needed, well, first of all, the magnetic chart this is a 2213 Alnico. Here's the, here's the frame. I'm sorry, it's a 123A-3. Oh, my bad. It's the same speaker. 123A-3 and a 2213 are the same speaker. So, there you go. Um, anyway, there's powdery corrosion in here. The magnet was down about oh, almost 2,000 gauss, 1,500, something like that. It's supposed to be 10,000 gauss, but it was in the 8,000s. Uh, now it'll be about in the 4,000s with the top plate removed, but it's going to get a full service cleaning and recharge. And here is my 2213 reproduction kit for the 123A-3 and 2213 and 2213H with nice uh, coating of aquaplaze on the cone so yeah just uh, more evidence that these need to be taken apart and cleaned after 40, 50 years and recharge. So those that say that's not true, I'm sorry, you're wrong. <laughs> if you want your JBLs to perform like they're supposed to, then they need uh, a servicing every now and then, like, I don't know, 40, 50 years, which is pretty good. So that's the least you can do for the Lansing uh, heritage is to take care of these things so they last for generations. Alrighty, see ya.